what's going on everybody welcome back to another video we're gonna be doing some public land hunting tonight uh, for squirrels I got the 12 gauge with me and uh, just to prove them on public yeah looks like we're gonna have a lot of other people walking around here so we gotta be extra careful um, where we're shooting because flintlock is open muzzle uh, archery is open and small game so we got a lot of guys out hunting here and uh, yeah just want to be extra careful tonight my plan for tonight is just to spot and stalk um, this is my normal squirrel spot I really like it here because if you listen I can walk pretty quiet I'll be able to walk even quieter once we get down here there's actually a uh, a paved road that we can walk on so I'm excited I haven't been out squirreling in a long time I took Parker the other day uh, my three-year-old son I took him on Thanksgiving I didn't film it or anything but we almost got shot so we didn't go too well uh, we had a guy with a 1022 shooting up over the hill here and I could hear the bullets going through the trees right above us so to, to say I wasn't a happy father is an understatement especially since it was his first time out but hopefully we don't have to deal with that again tonight come to a crossroads. Do I go left, straight, or off to the right? It sounds like there's goose hunters down there. Down near the lake. So I'm thinking going left. Because if I go straight, it's going to be a while till I'm in the woods. And I want to try to maximize the amount of time I have to hunt. So I'm going to go this way. So some in the crook of this tree and then ran up. I don't know. I never saw him fall. I mean, I blasted him. He was damn close. Oh, I see him. Nice little red. I'm going to go in there and get him. He's back on safe.
beautiful red squirrel. That's a that's a decent sized one. BB's uh kind of did a number on them. That's why I like using 22s, but beauty beauty red squirrel right there. Yes. We'll continue down this uh field edge, if you want to call it that. Looks like they just clear cut it to be honest with you. Maybe we can catch some more slipping up. Well, I've worked my way all the way up this field, turned to grass, and I'm really quiet right now. Um, have not heard hardly any squirrel activity. But, I mean, it's getting, the sun's going down over there. So I'm gonna just keep working my way up here, and uh, I got him. Huh. Hopefully he wasn't just falling and I actually did hit him. It wasn't that far of a shot. Probably like 30 yards. So, this is the tree I'm pretty sure he was in. Well, that's not good. Right? Yeah, he was in this tree. Maybe I didn't kill him. I swear I watched him fall. Oh, I found him. Right? You're dead? You're dead. I don't think he was in that tree. I don't, I don't think he was in this tree, but I must have messed up. Look at the size of this thing, guys. That is a hefty, hefty female. Wow. She's got some weight to her. I'll tell you what, I'm glad I didn't give up. Ouch, oh gosh, that was all thorns. Yeah, I am glad I didn't give up on that one. You know, that was something I was taught at uh, an early age. Was, if you're going to try to take an animal's life, and you can't find it right away, <coughs> you better give it 110% to try to find it. I'm glad I decided to walk up there. Found that squirrel. It's uh, it's getting a little late. That took longer than what it should have, but we're up here right near the trail, and hell, who knows? We might see one more. Okay, all right. Let's see if we can't maybe get one more. Who knows? We'll see what happens. Got him. Oh, there was another one. These red squirrels are hard. All right, there's two squirrels down out of one tree. Certainly can't complain about an outing like this. I mean, two squirrels back to back, same tree. 
There's squirrels going off everywhere. There's squirrels going off everywhere. It's like almost quitting time. <laughs> I'm like 90% sure that's a squirrel, a red squirrel chirping at me. But today you live. I'm gonna let you live today, buddy. I'll be back. So I'm gonna wrap this up, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. It helps my videos reach more people. Leave a comment. I reply to 99% of my comments. Um, I love talking to you guys. So I look forward to hearing from you guys in the comments. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.